this is Lord Ogham. Welcome to, I think it's part seven, something like that, of my Heavy Rain walkthrough. And we are, well, where we left off, um, we had a lazy son who keeps leaving apple cores on my sofa. You just know I'm going to have to mention that, but it did, it really did bother me. Um, also, it seems like, you know, we, the, we just can't bond with him whatsoever. The far and uh, Ethan, his father, has just started to have some kind of weird mental breakdown thing happening. So we're going to go from there and carry on and uh, see where we go. So resume game. That doesn't look good. See, he's got an origami figure in his hand. A dog. Oh, that's just not good at all, is it? You know, he kind has a bit of a weird thing go off in his landing of his house and, and uh, well, now he's in the middle of nowhere. Kind of be corner north. Strange. <laughs> Weird. Nah, here we are. Here's a new character. Uh, Scott something. Uh, you'll find out. And he... Well, you, you'll find out what he is. I'm not going to spoil it. I'm not going to explain it to you. You'll see it when we... Uh, you know, we'll see, you'll see it as, it as it tells you who he is, as it introduces the character. Oh, Scott Shelby, I think it is, actually. Lauren Winter. Ring any bells? Nope, can't say it does. Oh, that Lauren Winter. <laughs> yes, one. that Lauren Winter. The, left the, the one that the, money, that the money talks about. Money always points to the right person. Third floor, last door on the left, I saw it. I'll just walk up the stairs. Because I don't think this place has got an elevator that works. To probably fall to bits. Alright, so last door on the left. Now, uh, this one. Hello, Lauren. Lauren Winter. Sorry, I only see clients by appointment. Oh. Oh, didn't mean that. I, I took my hand off at controller there. That was my own fault. It's 50 bucks. I don't kiss and I don't do any weird shit. Fine by me. <laughs> What's classified as weird? One man's weird, another man's... Well, let's just forget that bit. Let's not go any further there. Put your money okay. on the table. You got exactly 10 minutes when the alarm rings. It's over, okay? Okay. You should take your clothes off. We ain't got all day. Actually, I'm not a customer. Oh, shit, a cop. I should have known. What do you want? A freebie? Is that it? Well, since you're asking, well, My offer name is Scott Shelby. Oh, I'm a private okay, detective. It. The families of the victims of the origami killer asked me to investigate the murders. I came here just to ask you some questions about Johnny. I already told the police all I know and I have nothing to add. Leave me alone. 
Let's convince her. The killer is walking around free as we speak. He'll kill again if he's not arrested. Hey, Johnny's dead, so what difference does it make? Uh, compassionate. I understand, Lord. I know what you're going through. Oh, yeah? You know what it feels like to find your own son's body on a wasteland? I'm sorry, I don't believe you have the slightest idea what I'm going through, Mr. Shelby. Okay, well, trick her. Or does that trick mean I'm going to do a magic trick and go, hey, find the card? I have nothing to say to you. Get out of here. If we don't find the killer, there'll be other mothers who find their son's body on a deserted wasteland. But, but, but you're right. Why should you care? It's not your problem anymore, right? Yeah, selfish. Your Johnny died. What do you want to know? Okay, so that's about, about Johnny. Johnny. What kind of kid was he? Johnny was really a good boy. Sometimes he fought with other kids who called me a, you know. Oh. In his I own mean, way, I think he understood. What lady was going of the on. night. <laughs> How did your son disappear? He used to go play with the neighborhood kids after school. It was pouring down something awful that day. I'll never forget it. All his friends came home around five. All except him. He never could tell time, could he? <laughs> Shouldn't joke, I'm sorry. When did you sound the alarm? About eight o'clock. I began to get worried. I went all around the neighborhood. I went to the wasteland where they like to play. I went to see his friends. I called the cops about ten o'clock. Do you know if they found anything on the wasteland? Any leads or witnesses? No. He said he must have run away and he'd probably end up coming back. Why didn't it happen? His body was found five days later with an origami figure in his hand and an orchid on his chest. Oh. That's awful. It really is. I'm sorry, Lauren. Um, I don't want to. Do you know, I need to com comfort you? Don't touch me! All right, calm down. My son was the most precious thing I had. The only good thing in my whole fucking life. He was taken away from me for no reason. Go calm away. down. Get out of here. Chill. All right, we'll go. Thank you for answering my questions. Well, if you remember anything, the smallest detail. Here's my card. Give me a call. All right, so let's get out of here. Oop, Ooh, not that close. All right. Well, we did our job here, and we've left her in tears. Oh, dear. oh, another one who's got a freaky thing go off all of a sudden, really quickly. Ah, asthma. Ah, so there we go. Oh, Laura, no Fire. Way, baby. It's me. Troy, what are you doing here? I already told you I don't want to see you anymore. Sorry, doll, but I really wanted to see you. Oh dear. Here you'll see the first proper QTE uh, quick time events, and that comes up really quickly. So, and we're gonna we're gonna try this. <laughs> I'm not very good at this usually, so uh, here goes.
What do you want, asshole? Lauren! What do you want, right. asshole? She's just swell. Now beat it, loser! Okay, I think we're gonna kick the door open. You again? If you're looking for trouble, you found it. I'm gonna beat the shit out of you. Oh! Oh, there we go, wrong one again. There we go. Missed. Oh! Aha! Uh -huh. Got that wrong. You miss now! You no stand no chance now! Get this! Boom! <laughs> Missed! Missed! And oh, nearly. Oh, headbutt. Table gone. Oh, we're playing now. And me gonna kick your ass now. Ow! Damn. Oh, you're in trouble now. I'm gonna shove that bottle right up your rectum. Boom, boom. Oh, feel the pain. Missed. Missed. <laughs> Headbutt to the stomach. Oh, left. Right. This is what Muhammad Ali taught me that move. I'll see you again, asshole. Okay, asshole. I'll kick your ass then as well. Are you alright? Yeah, I'm fine. Better than him, I guess. Who is he? An ex-client who thinks he owns me. He was getting violent, and I told him I didn't want to see him anymore. Well, you should be careful. He'll probably be back. Sorry about the mess. Mr. Shelby? Yeah. Thanks. You're welcome. So, about that freebie. <laughs> Oh dear, poor Lauren. I've got a limp now, look. Okay, so I'm going to pause it there because uh, it's been about 13 minutes, although I'll probably be taking a little bit of loading screen out so it'll be less. Anyway, I hope you enjoyed it. If I enjoyed a like, please do so. I think I deserve one for kicking ass like that. Come on, you must be proud of me, guys. And, uh, and I will uh, see you again soon. So for now, take good care of yourself, and goodbye for now, my friends.